station's closed. Come back another time. Okay. Well, right after the zombies started coming, they, Boston just guarded itself. Oh my god, Sean's dead. Technical. So what's your name? Helvetica. You can call me Hallie. Yours? Oh, that's Ben. He's from Cal Colorado. It's the backup generator, dude. Steam train, take a steam train, take a get steam train, take it back here. He's going. going. What? Wait, what? What did you go? Come on. Ben, I found tickets. Fine, plane tickets. Raleigh and C to Hartford, Connecticut. Whoa. What do we do? You have some experience flying, right? Yeah. General Entry 126, October 20th, 2018. It gets colder and colder every day. That's what Cuddy used to say before he passed. I haven't seen a new person in over six months. I just wish I could just meet somebody that I've already met before, like Cutter, or Sean, Holly, or Danny. Well, I can't see any of them again, really, because Cutter died in the crash, and Sean was shot by that army man, and Holly and Danny are in St. Louis, probably leading that pack of kids. I really hope I'll see them one, of, one again, but that'll probably never I'll be I'll be so thankful if I ever see any one of them again. This world is very slowly dying. The clouds in the air, because of the nuclear power plant, all over the world is spurting up toxic gases blocking out our sun. You know that plane that we were supposed to ride to Hartford? That crash. It landed in a field in a small town called Quakersfield, right outside Richmond, Virginia. So anyways, it's really hard living on the streets. It's hard living alone out here, I mean. I mean, I wish Montgomery was here, but she decided to go her own way up to Charleston, West Virginia. We don't know what happened. I'm really running low on food. Every neighborhood I come across to has either is either empty or already been raided. After all this time, I'm still taking Sean's advice and heading up to Boston. I don't even know if it's still there, but I'm mostly built on hope these days. Nowadays, people just kill other people just for sports. They have nothing better to do since all the electronics were suddenly shut off. Nowadays, I don't sleep for about two to three days at most. I try to keep moving as much as I can because I don't think I can take the road anymore. I keep dreaming about a sign that says, Welcome to Boston. I don't know what else to say at this point, so I'm just going to say this. No matter what happens, I will keep moving to Boston.